creating microservices with Quarkus. Um, it's pretty simple. Navigate uh, to code.quarkus.io in your browser. Uh, you can see a screen or like this over here. So it, it gives an option to choose um, all the libraries you want to build with Quarkus, uh, whether REST EG, Hibernet, AWS. There are many libraries available. You can choose whatever you want. To get started, I'll just create a basic um, RESTful service. Let's go ahead and give some package name here. Uh, demo. This is uh, this. Yeah, and you can choose your build tool if Maven or Gradle, whatever you're comfortable with, and then you can just hit on this button, generate your uh, project. So this will download uh, as as um, Maven Architect project um, in your computer. You can unzip it and then you know go through that. So we can just very well do it here in my command prompt over here. Um, so I can hit unzip. Um, Download slash do I can just do yeah and I can just see here I can just see one directory will be created over here so I can just say the rest services I can just check the content over here and uh, I can just start the Visual Studio Code uh, ID. Um, yeah, here it is. You can see the basic structure of the application is created. If I can expand this, I have a simple example resource creator, which gives me hello with the plain text uh, media type. Uh, let us run this application and just see over here. So I can just say ambient clean package uh, I can just say focus div so focus dev mode um, will enable us to achieve live reload of your, of your um, application uh, we'll see that in action in a while yeah so this this all these applications started you know on um, in 0 0.83 milliseconds and um, um, it has two features enabled. One is CDI by default, and then RESTEG. Basically, it's, it uses uh, JBoss RESTEG API to expose REST web services. Uh, let us hit this browser. And just say hello. Yeah. So, as a service is up and running, let us go back and change something. Yeah. Let's see. Hello. And let me refresh this. You see, you know, I don't have to rebuild the application because I have started uh, uh, the the project in uh, dev mode, Quarkus dev mode see uh, this particular option gives us um, feasibility to achieve live reload so which means i don't have to read up the application again and again um, so this is the basic demo of creating a microservices with uh, rest, rest exposing rest endpoint with focus in my next video i'll talk about uh, writing a cdi in this application uh, thank you